Alessandro. My name is Charles. Together we represent the McGill Rocket Team. This is our third year competing at IREF, and this year we're entering two projects. So the first project we're going to bring in is something we like to call Project Stella. That's a rocket that's about 14 feet tall and designed to travel all the way up to 30,000 feet uh, above ground level. It is a student-made propulsion system and, and an ejectable payload clock copter. So for the second project, that's Project Ares, that's going to be going to 10,000 feet and that's going to be a commercial off-the-shelf solid motor. It's also going to incorporate a payload which is a model of a human skull and what we're going to be doing is testing the effects of g-forces on the cranial fluids. As with most of the other teams at this competition, um, most teams end up uh, manufacturing their entire rocket in-house, uh, which is also something we do. Uh, consequently, the next video you're about to see is a time-lapse of us routing our molds for our airframe. <laughs> The rocket has to separate mid-flight. We developed our own in-house pyrotechnic separation mechanism and this year we are further building on that by optimizing it for higher altitudes. As well, we are coming up with an entirely new concept for a separation mechanism. So something we've been trying to accomplish for the past two years is to eject a foldable quadcopter payload from the rocket itself in mid-air. So the biggest challenge here is you don't know what kind of velocity it's going to have coming out. So we've come up with several new solutions to compensate for this. So that's just a quick snapshot of our project for this year. We wanted to thank the Ezra team as well as Spaceport America for hosting the competition this year. Um, additionally, thanks to all the other teams for helping us out in the past and good luck to all of you. We're very excited to see you guys at the competition. Uh, lastly, thank you to all of our sponsors for continuously helping us.